Hey everyone, the cool train guy here. As you can see, we are finally on the ship right now, Serenade of the Seas. Yeah. Yeah, we're yeah we're getting ready we're getting ready we're getting ready to sail away pretty soon. Yeah, the ship is humongous. I've already I've already uh I've already taken a look I've already taken a look on a lot of the floors. There's a pool. And, there, and there's a, a there's also a lot of bars here too. Playing live music there. I can see the, the street cars. The street cars down there. Yeah, when the ship when the ship does start moving, I am gonna start. I am gonna record it. I'm also going to be recording a little bit tomorrow morning because tomorrow morning we are we are just going to be sailing at sea. Uh, yeah, so yeah, so yeah, yeah, and we're not going to be at Cozumel until Monday morning, which I will record then. Yeah, we're all very excited. This is my very first time on a cruise ship, and there's the engine right there. A lot of smoke coming out. And there it is. Go to and there, and there is good old downtown Tampa. Just put, just put the cruisers blew the horn. I think they means they're about to pull out now. I started recording late, but the horn, the horn was loud. There are also a lot of people waiting to watch as we pull out. Oh yeah, we're moving very slowly. Couldn't notice that. We had to wait for this. There was another ship over. That other ship had to. We had to wait for that other ship to pull out before we did. Yeah, we we're moving very, very slowly. music down there so yeah bye bye Florida and, and we will be back here next week and when we, and when we get to Cozumel on Monday I think I'll try to I'll try to record if I wake up early enough I might try to record the cruise ship pulling into Cozum into Cozumel I'm starting to move a little faster now. I guess that falls under the category. There's also an old, uh, looks like, that looks like, an M, looks like an old MP15 locomotive right there. It's been sitting there. I'm not sure if it's still in use or not, though. I'm not at first, too. Most likely to get arrested. There's an old battle, old uh, World War II ship coming up here. I might try to get a video of it as we pass it. I know it's kind of, yeah, it's pretty boring that we're going so slow, which is why I'm not gonna record too much. But I'll record again later, depends on when we pass.
Yeah, I think it's about as fast as we're gonna go. The yeah, cruise ships don't go very fast at all. It's very cool. Oh. Alright, some very odd hotel all the way down there. And the <laughs> oh yeah, that is the aquarium. <laughs> oh, I wonder if you can take a tour of that at the aquarium. Yeah. yeah. This one, this one is yeah. so high up on All right, we're about an hour. We're about an hour out at sea now. 5:30, it's just starting to get dark. We haven't gone too far. I saw a map. We've only gone like I don't think we've even gone 10 miles yet. Yeah, the view out here is so nice. Following behind the other ship. all the way down there that we should be uh, at one point it's gonna be dark but uh, i think at one point we should be going under that bridge we, uh, when we get all the way down there we're just gonna take a very long time there's a fitness center right here and there and you can see the ships of moored. it's pretty big Of the bridge right now. Oh wow, it looks like it almost hit the top. Barely made it under the bridge. We're also about uh, just over two and a half hours in now. The lights on this bridge are beautiful. This is true. 
cruise is so far amazing. I'm also going to be taking some more videos tomorrow morning when we're out at sea because we don't get to Cosmel until Monday. And so tomorrow is Sunday. We're going to be out at sea. We're going to get some videos then. We should be almost in the Gulf of Mexico. We should be uh, completely surrounded by water soon. This thing is slow. changing colors. but not the ship, but not right now. Because this thing is, is huge. Yeah. 